Hey everybody, Keith Best here, and in this video, I just wanted to do a very quick overview of how the PHV Writer works. Now, when you first log in, you won't get all these up because obviously I've got like sort of lots of different projects on, um, and I've been playing around a bit. What you will see, you'll just have blank space, and you'll have this one here, the one with the plus on. Now, all you need to do is just click on that one and give your project a title. So your title is going to be something like, basically your title is going to be your keyword. Well, that's what I would do it. Chuck Accident Lawyer. Okay. So do Chuck Accident Lawyer. You don't need to put a description in. You can if you want, but I don't see the point. Do next. Okay. Next thing you want to do is put your keyword in which is going to be truck accident lawyer and any location. Let's see, Miami. And we'll have ooh, there's lots of Miami's. So we'll have that one. And then all you got to do is press get content. And there you go. That's going to go away. It's going to scrape the their first 10 results on Google, and it's going to bring it back. Now, what a lot of people get confused about is like, so when it comes back, there's nothing in here. Okay. There is nothing in here because it basically all comes over here. You've got all your meta titles. You've got all your meta descriptions, which obviously these are going to be good, especially if you're going to be like sort of spinning your meta titles, because you could just go one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Pull them in and just have a quick look and say, right, I don't want that. I mean, or you could put, instead of putting that there, you could say, okay, I can change that to X field. I could actually spell. Company name. So you change that and then you can change this to Oops. like that. Obviously you don't want that, so let's just copy that. Yeah. Get the P off. You can put there, you can put location in. And there you can put location in. And you've got that. So you've now got some fairly decent meta titles there. Obviously, you can play around with because you can put like commercial semi truck. If I just copy that, commercial semi truck action lawyers, and then do that. Truck action lawyer, do that. You've got your law, you can put your location in just like that. Okay. So you've now got very well optimized. And you know that these are optimized because these guys are all on page one. So you know that Google already likes them. But this has just made it more relevant for your area that you are targeting. And you can obviously do the same with your meta descriptions, just pull them across and you set them up to read doing. But then of course you can also do, let's have a look. You can build up now your actual document. So let's have a look at H1s. And so let's have our H1 there. We can change that if you want by doing that. And now let's have a 
some H2s. We'll have something like that, something like that. Oh, that's a good one. There's some pretty questions and answers in there. So we've got that. So after our H1, we want a paragraph. So let's close that up. Let's have a paragraph. Let's put that in. Quick check of it. Uh, That's a damn good paragraph because it's got nothing we need to change. Let's put another one in. Quite a good one there. So this one could be how our truck action lawyers can help you. So let's change these to H2s. Good. And then you just build it up like that. If you loved one, truck right? Because truck drivers are often injured. So we're getting lots of stuff here, which has got good content in. Um, and we can just build it up. Uh, just keep doing that. And of course, we can put our own information in if we want. Like sort of here. Um, you could you could have something like sort of we cover location, you know, and and then if you put like sort of cities type equals CSVT. Count equals five. That will give you a list of five cities. And I can just put and other areas in county or region, whichever one you want to use. So you can very, very quickly build up a, some content. I mean, just in the time I've been on here, let's just have a look at that. And let's just go to here. And I've done really nothing strenuous yet. There's 300 words there. And I've basically not touched the surface. You know, because I've really got here. Uh, We've got loads of stuff here where you can just pull stuff in. I mean, that's a big paragraph, so that's going to get us a few more words. So if you just do that, pull that in. And right, we've got Munley Law there. So basically, I would change that because we are working as lead gen, our uh, teams of lawyers are unique check that out so as you can see you can change stuff around commercial structure and as mike showed there's that other um tool which i'll be showing more when i do more thorough videos this is just a quick one for now which you can use to then rewrite these as well and get them totally unique and then, of course, if you're building a, your evergreen site, which is going to be used on hundreds and hundreds of different sites, then you can start going through and hand spinning them, as I showed. But as you can see, again, I've just put a couple of more things in there. Let's just put a questions and answers. Let's scroll down a bit, because, I mean, what you can do, let's do that. And let's have a look at... In order the lists. That's just a menu. 
That's where we go. That's the menu what I do. That's what I do. Let's have a look at this one. So questions and answers. If we paste that in there. So we've got driver error and equipment failure. And then you've got like sort of this one here. If we put that one in. We've got some good information there, which we can obviously like blend in. And then just after that, again, what, a couple of minutes, five minutes, just copy that. Drop it in there. And there we've got a 700 word article. No time at all, no effort. And it's just, very, 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 very quickly. Okay, guys, so remember, you'll start off with a project. You've got to put a project in. Once you do your search, you get your content. Nothing comes in this area here. It's all under the content over here. I'll go through the auto building from a template and all sorts of things like that. That's probably not something I'm going to use, but I will go through it. Um, obviously, you can spin stuff and all of that good stuff. Okay, hope that was useful. Catch you on the next video. Bye.